Welcome back to this war of mine. We are at the start of day five. Pavel has just come back with a bunch of supplies, specifically wood, quite a bit of wood and quite a bit of components, just general purpose components. So I need to make some stuff, but let's take a look at what our people need. Okay, Pavel is very hungry, so why don't you go eat? Katya is also very hungry. Bruno, how are you doing? You're just hungry. Okay, uh, go have some canned food. Should tide you over. And then some people are going to need to sleep. I think Pavlin and Katya both need to sleep. I wouldn't mind another helping. Oh, she's still hungry. Alright, um... Let's see, Bruno, all right, Bruno's good. Yeah, so they're both just hungry, not very hungry. I just have one more can. All right, um, I'm gonna save the can. And both of you are tired, so why don't you go have a sleep? Bruno is 100% good to go, so let's get him doing stuff. Let's go check the news. You're listening to Radio Pagoran. We regret to announce that our colleague died, wait. Didn't that already... Wait, didn't that already happen? Th yeah, th look, that already happened on day three. We regret to announce that our colleague, Joven, died this morning. He, he was resurrected and he died again? Okay. Weather? Cool outside with clouds and possible rainfall. Our advice for cold evenings is grab a good book, okay. music. Mass graves? Didn't I already get that before too? weird. I feel like I'm repeating stuff. Okay, Bruno, um... We need to make stuff, don't we? Hold on. Is that, whoa! Someone's at the door. Two people are at the door. Need help. Uh... Katya, you're good at bargaining. Please come here. And Bruno can back her up. We do have a knife. Come on. Come on. Our mom is sick. Please help us. I do have spare medicine. Our mom needs medications. We live several blocks away from here. Our mom's very ill. She needs medications. Could you please spare any? Without your help, she'll die. After daddy went to fight, we have only her. Please, help us save her. I don't need the medication right now. I might need it later, but I don't need it right now. Okay, I'm gonna give it to him. Thank you. Quickly, let's get the medicine to mom. They could be lying. They could be lying. They could just be trying to get supplies from people. Maybe they're just gonna go sell it. I don't know. Okay, that's, yeah, that's just a general pile. I thought that was something else. Okay, cool. B wow, a bunch more supplies. Eight wood, 14 components. Sweet. All right, we need to build stuff. Time to build.
Ooh, and Pavel's bio is updated. Oh, because of what just happened. Day five. Poor children. I hope our meds are enough to help their mother. Okay. I don't feel like I need more than two beds. Because I can't picture a night where I'm going to want everybody to sleep. There's going to be at least one person standing guard, so I think two beds is good. It hasn't really gotten too cold yet, so I don't need to build that. Radio we got. Chairs. I, what does that do? It doesn't seem worth it. It'll make us feel better. Uh, yeah, I can focus on luxuries later. I think we need a rainwater collector. It takes an awful lot of components, though. Stove is fine. Metal workshop, I already have one. We do need rainwater. We also need food, though. Hold on. What can I make here? Oh, we need a shovel. But we do have enough to actually make a shovel. And the rainwater collector. So let's do it. Let's make a shovel and then a rainwater collector and then perhaps a filter. Pavel is... Oh, Pavel's actually content. Oh, because of the good deed we just did, right? I think? Yeah. Those kids are very brave. They risk their lives walking around the neighborhood to save their mother. Interesting. So your actions there do have a psychological impact on your people, which makes sense. It would. <laughs> Where are my cigarettes? Sorry. I still don't know how to roll them. Even though I have tons of herbs to do that with. 16C? Alright, well, it's not cold yet. Now we have a shovel. Yeah, it's back a rainwater collector. Oh, right. Uh. Doesn't this need to be on, like... How is the rain going to get to it? Is that just automatic and it doesn't matter where you put it? Or do you have to... Like... There's no holes in the roof, so... And we can't, we can't actually go up here, can we? No. I've never actually gone out to the side before. Look at this. Okay, I guess it doesn't matter where I put it. Let's put it next to the stove. I'm hungry. Yeah, well, too bad. Suck it up, Pavel. Get to work. Lazy. What are you doing sitting in a chair? It's like somebody told you to do it. Single use. There's no point in making that then. Yeah, not until I actually have water. Whoa, whoa, wait. Wait, what? Did I accidentally tell him to make it? I don't know what just happened. Maybe I should... Uh, yeah, maybe I should upgrade this thing. Maybe that's what I should do next. I probably should. Alright, how does this work? Some relatively clean water you'll need to prepare a good meal or make alcohol. Need a filter? It makes four. 0 0.5 plus five hours. So does that mean I have to wait five hours, but I only have to work at it for half an hour? While we wait for it to collect water, I guess? In that case, let's actually make the filter. Maybe I should make two. Maybe I should make two. Let's make two. Got a couple hours before nightfall. All 
Alright, so this time we're going to be sending two people out to go scavenge, and then leaving one person to guard. So we should be able to get a lot more supplies now. Okay. Looks like Katya just got a good night's sleep. Excellent. Oh, I can't make two at the same time. Oh, I guess I can't. Okay. Yeah, so it takes a little bit of time to prepare, and then we just leave it and let it collect water. Alright, so... Two of our three people are content. That's good. Alright, so we just have to wait for it to filter. Cool. And it is about nighttime. Okay, should be able to scavenge a lot more things this time. So who stays behind? For some reason, Bruno still can't carry that much stuff. I'm not really sure why. So I guess he's got to be the one to stay behind. Alright, Bruno the cook can guard. <laughs> of course, the cook is the best one to guard a place. That's conventional wisdom, isn't it? What the? Can I not have two scavengers? What? Huh? Are you telling me you can't have two scavengers? I guess you can't. Huh. What? That, what? That seems completely arbitrary. I don't, I don't understand. That doesn't make any sense. There's no reason two people can't go out to scavenge. Am I missing something? That, that just seems stupid. Okay. Alright. Uh... Bruno, I'm going to put you on guard. You're not hungry, so hopefully you'll be the most focused at watching for any enemies and not thinking about food. Katya can sleep? She doesn't need to sleep yet. Could have two guards. Nah, let's have her sleep. Then I guess Pavel will scavenge. Question is, where? I should go back to the... Yeah, I should go back to the school. It even says there's lots of food, and now that I have a shovel, I can do some... Yeah, I can, yeah, I can do some really good stuff in there. Looks like Sniper Junction is new. The city center used to be beautiful, with parks, squares, and monuments, surrounded by old buildings. Unfortunately, numerous incidents with civilians shot out there earned it the nickname Sniper Junction. We may find valuable things there, but it's very risky. Hell no. Let's go to the school. Do I need the crowbar? Well, I definitely want that. Definitely want the shovel. And I definitely want the knife. Do I want the crowbar too? Yes. There's gotta be a way to make more space. There's gotta be. I really need to get... I need to get either more space or more people. peek in and make sure nobody's taking up residence. Eh, yeah, just the rats up there. Okay, I started working my way that way. What's up here? What was wrong with this? Oh, I think it was just, yeah, I guess it was just this pile. So let's see how fast this is with a shovel. Ooh, it's way faster. Oh my god. That is so much better. So we really need food. General supplies are great, I will take them for now, but we really need food. Try that shit open.
Lots of supplies. Still need food. Alright, can you get up here? Can you jump? Yes, sweet. Ooh, what is that? It's a mini pile. There's no reason to get through that. No point. I suppose I could probably just jump down here, right? Mm hmm. Ooh, is there something out? Can I go out here? No. Do I want to waste... Let's not waste my tool. Wait, what do you do? I know it won't. Go the other way. I really want to find food. Alright, so I think I already checked this place, but let me check right now again. Should have plenty of time. It's only just about midnight. A little bit past midnight. Alright, now let's go down. This is where I barely had any time to explore. I could get through this door if I had a saw blade. Interesting. Alright, there's got to be some good stuff in there. I think I checked this before. Alright, let's go down. Take a peek. Looking good. Oh, we can go to like a different place? Or, or is this to hide? They took... Wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. They took my food again. What, what, what? There's someone in here? Oh, shit. Okay. Uh... Hold on. What happens if I do this? What is this? Is that hide? That is hide. Hmm. He's asleep. Can I sneak past him? We're about to find out. Slowly. Slowly. Close it. Okay. Oh shit, yeah. These are the homeless people that I said were in here. Or maybe we'd be in here. When will we eat again? I guess they, they probably don't have any food. It sounds like they don't have any freaking food. Shit. Maybe all the food is inside of that place that you need a saw blade to get into. Is he still sleeping? Please still be sleeping. Yes, he is. I have a little bit more time. A little bit more time. Oh, he just woke up. I hear something. Okay. I better go check it. Oh, go. 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 All right, I'm getting the hell out of here. That was close. Fuck, I guess I'm not getting any food. No food. All right, so what do I have then? What do I need more? I need components more than I need wood. So let's do that. More wood, god damn it. Need to go pretty soon. That's more wood. Ah, fuck, I gotta go. Well, at least we'll have some water. I can 
relieve our hunger pains? Kind of. Well, we can make plenty. Oh, God damn it. Katya? Or Bruno? Was it Bruno on guard? Bruno was on guard. God damn it, Bruno. Shitty guard. They stay stole our filter and our water. And our bullets. And our food. In other words, the stuff that mattered. <sighs> Too bad we had no weapons. Alright. I need to make another weapon. So I can leave one here. Alright, I've got to make another weapon. Pavel's tired, you go sleep. She slept poorly. Bruno's tired, you go sleep. Alright, caught you. Check the news. Mass graves? Again? Beware of bands of looters roaming the city. It's best to lock your doors and stay inside. Yes, I noticed. Cool, clouds, possible rainfall. Okay. I need weapon parts to make a knife. So I need to leave our one knife here if I want them to be able to defend themselves. Wonderful. Hold on, we do have water, don't we? D don't we have water? Yeah, we do have some left over. I thought they stole three and that's supposed to make... Four, so that would have left one, right? I'm not sure where the other water came from. But, okay. Well, we could dissolve some sugar in water and have some... Sugar water. We'll live like ants. Okay, small amount of components, a lot of wood, a lot of wood. Can I upgrade anything that matters? Need more components. Don't need any of that stuff. Probably need more components for this one too. Yep, a hell of a lot more components. Shit. Alright, well nobody's horribly hungry, right? No, they're just normal hungry. At least they're content. Yeah, she's content because the kids as well. Ooh, Bruno has something new. I used to be an optimist. One of those people who'd have sworn that war wouldn't come. Wars happened far away, in third world countries. Or so I thought. Even when I was listening to the news getting scarier day by day, I did not believe all that was about to happen. I think I should just end the day. I mean, what the hell else can I do? Can I make another filter? What's the point? I don't need more water. And the weird thing is, it kind of seems like water is just used for food. It's not... Like, water and food are kind of the same thing. It seems like you can't actually drink water on its own. So water on its own, I think, is useless. Except as maybe a crafting ingredient. Yeah, I think I just need to end the day. We really need food. I'm not, like, missing somewhere I haven't explored in here, am I?
I don't think so. Nah. Alright. Can she sleep if she slept poorly? No. Alright, everybody's good. Yeah, I'm just gonna end the day. There's, there's nothing to do. Okay. We need food. We really need food. Even if it's dangerous, I gotta go somewhere to get food. Without a saw, I can't really do much in the shell at school. Unless I go amongst the homeless people. And hope they don't kill me, but they were complaining about food, so I don't think they're gonna have any freaking food. I haven't been here. Oh. This old apartment building is owned by an elderly couple and their son. They're still around. We can try to steal or take them by force. No. This place doesn't have any food left. Lots of food, okay. If we're desperate, we could try to steal from them. I want to go somewhere where I don't have to fucking steal. But that's kind of the problem, isn't it? If I want to go somewhere where I don't have to steal, I need to put ourselves in danger. Supermarket. Other scavengers. Hmm. Might try the supermarket. I'm not going to Sniper Junction. It's only got some food anyway. Whereas the supermarket, of course, has lots of food. Alright, we're going to the supermarket. And we gotta take a weapon, so I'm sorry, but... I mean, what, if a raider comes, what are they going to steal from us anyway? We don't have anything to steal. Unless they want lots of herbs and wood. Alright, Bruno, you go. Katya, um... Uh, you slept poorly, so why don't you sleep? Bruno, guard. Instead of bringing a crowbar, let's do that. Knife. Do I bring a shovel? It didn't say that I should bring a shovel, so it's probably not that big of a deal. Yeah, okay, okay I'm, I'm not gonna take a shovel. Okay, this is gonna be dangerous. But here we go. Okay, is that a- that, those are weapons. Well, let's take this freebie here. You take the upstairs and the roof, okay. Uh, oh, hi. <clears throat> I'm just gonna yoink these and, uh, hello, sir. Should be enough for both of us, don't worry. Oh, okay. Alright, cool. Cool. Not gonna fuck with you. You got a weapon, I got a knife. Weapon parts. Nice. I'm not gonna bother with the sugar. That doesn't matter. Nor do the parts, really. I'll take them for now and probably ditch them later. I don't know what the hell to do with the coffee. I'm not sure how to brew it. I probably need to upgrade the stove or something. I'm just gonna leave them for now. They're not that important. I don't need electric parts. I don't need wood. Let's not ditch my knife. I don't know. I'll swap stuff, around, swap stuff around if I need to. Alright, don't want to get in their way. They're probably taking the best stuff. What did I just take? Tobacco. Nah.
Ooh, a food cart. <laughs> I wonder if they'd mind if I ran ahead of them. They probably would. Hello? Ooh, there's some stuff they haven't opened. You don't want to cause trouble here, trust me. I won't, I won't, I won't. Yeah, go over there. Okay. Sweet, we can get some special stuff. Come on, come on. Med ingredients. Okay. Broken shotgun. Ooh. Alright, broken pistol. Bunch of weapon stuff. Alright, I don't need more wood. I do not need electric parts. Could probably trade those. Valuable stuff. Gunpowder. Hmm, should probably keep that. I don't really need parts either. I really need components the most, I think. Bandages. I think I already have some. Let's see if I can break through that thing there. Fertilizer. Books. Hmm. I've got to think of trading value, too. Like, quality roll-up could be worth quite a bit of food, maybe. But then again, food is already very valuable. I have no hopes of fertilizing anything for a while yet. Take the book for now, I guess. Tons of ammo. If a trader comes by, I should be able to get a lot of good stuff. What is in here? Looks like a little storage room. I suppose those are barrels of food, please. What are these? Come on, I just need some food. Fuck. I got some really good stuff, I just don't have food. Is there anything they have not forced their way into? Yeah, it looks like they've been over the whole thing. Ooh, food! Canned food! What do I want to dump for that? <laughs> Sorry. Food is more important than books. I'm gonna find food in this rubble here, but let's check anyway. Got a bit of time. Okay. I can't carry that much. Good. More for me. Ooh, what's over here? I want to especially look for things they have not opened. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What are you doing? What are you, what are you running? Got my eye on you, okay. What the? Oh. Where, where are you going? Oh, are they leaving? Oh, they are leaving. Okay. Sweet. Bye bye. Yeah, there's some really good stuff here, especially for a trader, but I just need to hope a trader comes by before we all starve to death, I guess. Ooh, raw food. And a pile of rubble somehow. Okay, what do I do for that? Well, weapons are great, but I can't actually make anything from them yet. I have shell case... Hmm. Ammunition. It just says ammunition for firearms, so is that just generic ammunition? I think it is. Which means I don't actually need the gunpowder, because I already have ammunition. So...
Maybe I should dump the water. The water's useless without food. And I feel like the water's worth a lot less to a trader than gunpowder. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna dump the... Ah. Gunpowder's better to trade. Water means I don't have to make more filters and wait for the water to filter. I already have six water, though. It takes, what, two or three to make food? I'm gonna keep the water. Oh my god, okay. This is beautiful. Beautiful. Yeah, they left behind a lot of good stuff. So I'm gonna keep searching. I was thinking they took the best stuff, but it looks like they left some good stuff. A faded leaflet with skull and crossbones reads, Danger, do not touch unexploded ammunition. Any, any weapons, ammunition, or equipment left behind or unexploded may be booby-trapped. Do not touch anything. Do not risk severe injury or death. Report any such finds to the nearest army outpost. Okay. I don't think I can afford not to touch them, to be honest. So. Whatever. Hope I don't blow my arms off. really good stuff here. But the only reason I'm alive is because I'm lucky that the other looters did not try to shoot me. The next group I meet here might not be so nice. Alright, we gotta go soon. It's all about stacking. I think I touched on the major places. I think I touched on pretty much everything. I think. Alright, let's go. Please tell me we weren't robbed. Although, again, it probably doesn't matter that much if we if we were. Please don't be robbed. Okay, we weren't. Night was calm. It seems that Bruno is starting to feel a bit unwell. Shit, and now I wish, wish I had that medicine. <sighs> but we do have some medicine ingredients. So we could potentially make some, somehow. We have tons of stuff to trade. And we should have enough food to feed everybody, most of the way. But mostly what we have is just stuff to trade and stuff that can be used to make good stuff later, but not be used right now, because we just don't have good enough stuff to repair these weapons. We need to upgrade. Okay, well that was a pretty good turn of events, because things were starting to look really hairy there with the lack of food, but... Finally, we actually found some, thank god. Think I'll end this episode here? So, I hope you've enjoyed so far, and I'll be back soon.